told you and we decided you know let's do it in like 2020. Well, we kind of, I uh, know, um, ironed a lot of things already. Pero siempre may mga kailangan to finalize. Um, you know, it's not easy para preparing for the you know. Pero we're happy na marami tumutulong sa amin, you know. And magaling yung wedding organizer namin, si Amanda Tiron. <laughs> Shout out. Um, so, yun, um, we're kind of like, so far, okay, okay naman, yung smooth naman. We still have enough time to really iron things out. Pero, parang si Sarah yung mas hands-on sa preparation. I think we've covered 50% of the organization and the planning. Um, next month, I'm picking up my dress, and um, we're working on the small little details na lang. So yeah, mawawala sa dali si Sarah, kukunin niya na lang. Pero yun nga, aabangan natin sa iba't ibang shows ng ABS-CBN yung eksaktong data and platforms. Oo, oh, oh, oh. and platforms. Hindi ko na kami sa ato. Pero nga, may tanong pa rin si Nani. Kasi doon kami ng BTR, but can you just go back to that proposal? Kasi you were, you were the same, Sarah, that you, that it was unexpected. So, yeah, can you, why and can you speak back to that? Yung araw na yun kasi, we scheduled that day, because we were there for four days in Zermatt. And then, nung first, second, and third day, medyo gloomy, umuulan, the fourth day, lumabas yung sun, and we decided to go on a hike, na hindi madali. <laughs> so, nag hike muna kami, and then um, we ate somewhere, and when we stepped out of that restaurant, that's where we decided to do it. And that's why it was so unexpected, kasi <laughs> nag hiking talaga kami, naka backpack kami pareho, uh, naka hiking boots, and. Um, it was so unexpectedly beautiful. Sabi niya sana daw pinagsaloon ko muna siya bago kami walk yet. Sinakabonet ako. Pero parang it just felt like the right moment for me. And I was really planning it on that trip. Um, I didn't really have a specific date or anything. I just wanted na, na perfect yung setting. And I think the hype also kind of resembles our relationship na it's an uphill hike but at the end it's all worth it. Yes, and wala, wala kang kaide at hindi yan Wala talaga, wala at all. 27. 2017. Yeah. So, uh, Alan, that's why. Ayan, ito talaga yung ano eh, pag-ibig na nasubaybayan namin eh, no? <laughs> Wala nung, ano, 2012 kayo una nagtambal, di ba? Yes. Ano to, makapiling kang, ano, makita kang muli? Maka, makapiling kang muli. Makapiling kang muli, ayun. Chart, um, totoo ba, kaya napunta sa show na yun, sa serya na yun si Sarah, you requested for her, tama ba yun? Sino nagsabi sa akin? <laughs> <laughs> Oo, parang, ah, parang, tapos, tapos na nung stars na kayo, sa so parang gusto mo siya makapartner, parang gano'n, totoo ba yun? Yes. Kayo. Pero sino nagsabi sa iyo? Wala. Well, 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 oh, I heard that before pa. Yes, yeah, so mm -hmm. I wanted to work with her. Pero na-meet mo na siya before that? Na-meet ko na siya before that. Oh, so, doon pa nang attract ka na kay Sarah at gusto mo na siya maging leading lady. Although kontratida siya noong time na yun, si Carla talaga yung partner mo, di ba? Yes, yeah, so... So, ikaw talaga yung unang na-inlab. Doon sa ano, nagkatalo pa kayo sa video, di ba? Well, siya talaga. <laughs> Oh, pero alam mo yun, Sarah, technically, mm -hmm. ikaw. Hindi ko alam eh, kasi sige na nga ako. <laughs> oh, ikaw, Sarah, ano ba? Pero ikaw, di na-attract ka na agad when you ano, first met chart. Oo oh, naman. Diba? Oo oh, naman. Um, aside from Guapo, na-attract ako sa personality ni chart. And the, we got along so well and so fast. Na ang dami kasing, ang dami namin things in common in terms of her personality, um, in terms of what we like, 
adventures kami pareho, scuba divers kami pareho. Um, malalim siyang mag-isip and I like meaningful deep conversations and um, aside from that, talagang we got along well and pati yung parents ng isa't isa. We, we got to know each other very well. Okay, so balikan natin yung timeline ng inyong love story. 2012 yon. Kailan bali nag-official kayo after the teleserye? So 2012 pa rin. And then... No, and, and then you got pregnant 2013 ba? Um, sorry. Yes. Ayun. Tapos yung time na yun, nagpunta ka ng Switzerland, bigla ka nawala. Meron ka pinagtakala na matindi sa buhay mo nun, di ba? May legal battle and all. Was there a time na parang gusto mo nang sumuko nung sa hirap na yun ang pinagdaanan nyo nung, nung anong yun, nung panahon na yun? Well, nahirapan naman talaga ako kasi iisipin mo ba naman at the age of such a young age, ang dami mong pinaproblema instead of just thinking about um, raising a healthy, beautiful boy. Ang dami kong pinaproblema. But then, I'm also very blessed and very lucky na hindi ako nag-iisa while I was going through that kasi I had child, I had my parents, I had his family, I had my friends and Switzerland. So, mas mahirap siguro talaga kung ako lang yung mag-isa na pinagdaanan ko yun. Siguro gusto ko talaga mag-evolve. But then I had them, so... So, Charlie never left her nung mga times na yun, yung trying times na yun. Hindi ka nawala sa tabi ni Sarah. Hindi talaga ako na, nawala sa tabi niya. Well, physically, you know, I was here and she was there, but every day we would talk to each other, every day, you know, we would communicate. And then, maraming din nakakaalam. During that time, <clears throat> um, nagkapaalam ako dun sa teleseryo kasi may teleseryo akong ginagawa nun. If I could be for four days, five days, pupunta akong Switzerland for four to five days, and then babalik ako dito just to see her para lang kamustahin yung pregnancy niya and then yun nga, pag may mga scheduled check-ups to the doctor talagang lumipad ako dun and when Zion um, was born I had five days in Switzerland kasi nga tinatapos ko yung teleserye ko during that time nagpaalam ako sa producer if I could leave and thankfully pinayagan nila ako and then exacto when I went to Switzerland on my last day, uh, Zion was born. Nakakalungkot lang. Eh, masaya ako dahil naabutan ko you know, si Zion. But then the next day, I had to leave. So, marami kami mga ganong moments na pinagtaanan na mahirap. Pero, yun nga, parang it, it made us stronger together. Okay, tapos um, two years ago, nag-propose ka na Chardon nga sa Zerman. Kaya na nyo na-decide na um, you'll get married na ng March 20th. Ano, naisip ka na yun before pa or this year nyo lang na pag-decisionan? Well, after the proposal, we were planning it na. And then, all of a sudden, um, uh, the Luna Sangre happened. And then, parang we, we wanted to take our time. Parang we didn't want to rush it, di ba? So we wanted parang everything stable, everything is relaxed, and, and then um, then Kai arrives in our lives, and then so na push back with the wedding, and then now finally parang ito na talaga yung right time for us. Sana mas dera time na parang may jana ginip ka, na sa dami na tatanong, kaya naman may kakasal kay Richard, kaya naman di ba parang bakulit yung mga tao. And we saw you nung unang-una mong sinuot yung engagement rin sa premiere ng isang movie mo, di ba? So, na ano ka ba no? na kakaisa yung mga tanong? Ay, buwan lang kung kailan? Hindi <laughs> naman. Honestly, hindi naman. Um, kasi masaya naman ako. We're in a very stable relationship. And I'm very stable. He's very stable. Grabe yung unawaan namin sa isa't isa. So, um, unbothered naman ako sa sa ganong bagay dahil alam ko you know in God's perfect time darating talaga kung kailan dapat mangyari yun so masyado mm -hmm. tapos birthday mo na sa Wednesday di ba sir? ikaw na eh yeah. lalit na happy birthday <laughs> thank you o tapos uh, so ano may plans pa kayo for your birthday o ito na ba yung birthday gift na hinihintay mo for, for this year? of course um, ang daming blessings this year for, for me for all of us um, but I'm, I'm happiest when we, we're just all together, completo kami, and 
uh, dinner kami. That's that's how I wanted simple but meaningful. Thank you, si Jerry. Yeah, thank you, Alan. Oh, uh, ilinawin ko lang po. Yung sila ni Richard kanina. So aabangan uh, niyo talaga sa mga shows sa ABS-CBN na exact date po. March year 2020 po. Okay. Oh, hindi ko So March 2020 year po yung 2020 ah, sa uh, isa sa mga shows ng abs sa maraming shows. Sa maraming shows to platform. Ang sinabi ka nila, March 2020 po yung year. Kasi paulit-ulit si Alan, baka, baka makonfuse, no? So, so aabangan natin ang isa sa mga shows, di ba? Uh, sa maraming shows. Yung uh, ano, pinaka-official announcement, isa sa mga shows. Correct, correct. Pero yun nga, yung mga wedding details, ahati at ihin sa mga shows at social media platforms ng ABS-CBN. So yan, si Jerry magtatanong na. Ano yung reaction ng pamilya niya, especially sa parents, nung finally, ito na may cancel na nga kanina? Very happy. Um, Siyempre matagal na nila hinihintay ko, especially for me as an only girl, having a Muslim father, a Christian mom. They're, they're very religious and they're very, um, but, an, 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 tradition, yung sumusunod talaga sa tradition. So, ito lang talaga yung hinihintay na lang mangyari and they're very, very happy and excited that it's finally happening. Yeah, same here. Um, yung parents ko, after we got engaged, um, lumipad sila sa Switzerland. Yung photo, I'm not sure, ang pinakita yung photo yaga ng buong family namin. Na we all went to Switzerland kasi gusto ko nga makita ng parents ko where Sarah grew up and you know, tinor namin sila sa Geneva and you know, nagkaroon ng bonding moments yung uh, parents ko and parents niya, especially you know, dun sa Switzerland. So, yun, we're, we're all excited. After the wedding, may honeymoon pa kayo? Siyempre naman. <laughs> Mga gano'ng katagal at meron na pang kung saan kayo pupunta? Mga six months na naman. Hindi. <laughs> <laughs> um, as of now, wala pang definite plan. Um, may mga ano na kami, may mga shortlist na kami kung saan yung honeymoon na. Hindi pa itong kumbaga sa dami ng mga paglalabasan ng tips. So, parang reality show na rin. Nagkakaroon <laughs> Ah, uh, hindi naman. Um, kasi spread out naman yung 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 guestings namin, parang updates lang din siguro and um, hindi hindi naman parang reality show. Um, but yeah, you guys will get updated for sure. Um, thank you. Kaya may kalimutan ako, I'm sure na pili niyo na yung ginawa at Ninang, pero si, at, si Tita Annabel for sure, ano magiging hands-on niya sa mga ganitong event ng panilya? So malamang meron din siyang piniling ano, gusto niya mag- guest list siya. Di ba? I'm sure. May listahan siya ng Ninang at Ninang na, you know. So we're still collaborating on that list. There's two brides. <laughs> Oh, pero paano nyo ano, susolusyonan yung SARS? Personal pa rin kayo ang pipili or pwedeng may influence na ganit kita Annabelle yung bubuo ng inyong Nino at Nina and the whole entourage? Well, we'll, we'll try to meet halfway kasi good intentions din naman si Tita pero um, sabi nga namin mag-renewal of vows sila ni Tito Eddie <laughs> Paano kumuha din din sa lili niya? <laughs> But we'll meet halfway for sure. Pero may nagpili na kayo ng sarili nyo? Meron. Kami meron na kaming shortlist. Yung talk to them na rin? Hindi pa. After today. After today. Okay. Some. We spoke to some of them. Mga ilan yan, Chard? Na-estimate mo? 50, ano, pairs? Yung sa listahan namin, mga 12 pairs, 15 pairs. Nung nang dumating yung listahan ni Ma'am, may 30 pairs yata o 40. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Pero important 
Tapos nung ilaanab na, may ayaw niyang i-acknowledge na nang dito siya dito. <laughs> Oo, kasi, at, ah... Uh, Kaya, ba't hindi ko siya nakikita? Hindi, <laughs> nakatago daw siya. <laughs> ayaw niyang i-acknowledge siya, tapos hindi daw siya magpapa-interview. Pero, <laughs> early bird si Tita Annabelle. Oo, oh, mahaga kasi talaga okay. yun yung mga giveaways. <laughs> Special giveaways siya mula sa isang sponsor. USS, thank yeah, you very much. Nagpagawa talaga sila ng magandang... No, of course, we, we wanna thank my mom kasi nga sobrang hands-on din niya dito. And, um... Uh, very good intention siya when it comes to our wedding and with but so wedding Elvis and everyone. So, yun talaga ang ano niya, yun talaga ang forte niya. Thanks, ma. Yan, naiiyak na siya, Char. Pero, nas, mas nasila yung kaharap niya sa, uh, sa audience listening. Pero ito na, ang next naman tatanong, si Tita Aster Amoyo. Hindi ko makita ang likod niyo eh. Ah, okay. Ay, <laughs> ay, okay. Okay. okay na ako kay ganito. Sed, so mukha takpan. Buka muna. Okay. Um, Chard at saka, uh, oh, ngayon pa lang, at saka si uh, uh, Sara, congratulations in advance. Uh, kasi at least kay papano natundo ka na yung, you know, yung speculation sa mga tao. Kaya nung patalag ito magpapakasal after, uh, after si yung engaged, no? Um, Anong magiging papel ng dalawa niyong anak sa wedding niyo? Si Kai at saka si Sai. For sure, uh, part po sila ng entourage. Um, but most likely, ring bearers. Yung dalawa. Magkakaroon ng uh, special participation for sure. Silang dalawa. And si Kai, naisipan namin um, kung anong... Kasi, kasi ngayon po, malapit na po maglakad si Kai. Konting push na lang po mga, mga one week. <laughs> so, I think by by the wedding, makakapaglakad na po siya by himself or with Zion. So, most likely, ring bearers or uh, ano pa ba yung mga... Uh, Pati sa honeymoon kasama yun. Bible, Bible bearer. Hanggang honeymoon, ano? <laughs> Charge yung mga kapatid mo, ano magiging uh, participation sa wedding? Sinong tatoy yung best man? Um, yan yeah, ang no, sa amin soon. Pero, gusto ko nga sana lahat sila. <laughs> um, yeah, but everybody will have a special participation, definitely. And my brothers are all very supportive. Um, especially si Mon, recently he's been you know, helping us out a lot. Um, well, he likes also organizing things, so he's, he's been helping us even at the Rufa. Um, but everybody will have, you know, special participation. Chard, uh, tulad ng sinabi nila kanina, uh, your love life has been an open book to the public. Um, paano mo naramdaman na si Sarah na talaga is the one for you? I mean, kanina kasi sinabi mo, sa kanya ka naging masaya, sa kanya mo nakita lahat. Uh, what about your previous ex? Hindi ka ba nag-enjoy? Hindi ka mas naging masaya? Huwag na natin pag-usapan yung past. Um, ang importante is now and the future. Um, like what I said, si, si Sarah nga yung talagang um, nagpasaya sa akin. Uh, nagkaroon ako ng uh, stability you know, as a man. And she was there for me. And I was there for her all throughout the years. And yeah, we're, we're happy. And I can see myself being with her for the rest of my life. Lastly, alam, alam namin na may pinagdaanan talaga kayo. Sabi nga ni Jenny kanina sa kanina live. Sobrang pinagdaanan ng respect to uh, careers niyo at saka pati, at, pati personal na buhay. Um, did you ever imagine na we will stick it out together? And at the same time, lahat yung malalagpasan, ngayon sa nakikita namin, parang sobra-sobra, para pang naging blessing in disguise dahil nakalipat kayo dito sa kapabilyo na po. You know, during our relationship, we really had a lot of um, hard times in terms of, you know, um, we were tested. You know, our relationship was tested. And at the same time, um, during those hard times, you know, in our personal lives, you know, in our careers, um, all we had was each other. You know, there was a time that, you know, I realized who were my real friends, who were the real people around me, you know, and I needed that. 
I needed that in my life and all throughout the, those time si si Sara yung kasama ko and we grew together and you know, I'm, I'm very thankful for, for her during those times and until now Thank you to Oscar ito ang um, ito magtatanong naman ang editor ng People's, to, uh, People's Tonight yan, si Ian Parinas ay ito na daw yung Ian ah, syempre gusto niya po pala hindi pala uh, editor ng People's Tonight pero presidente ng speed yan yeah. Congrats mo dyan, Charles, tsaka kay Sarah. Kaya lang ano eh, since marami nang natanong sa kanila, gusto kong hingin yung reaction ni Tita Annabel. Ayaw mo? Tara, nakaano ka lang dyan, Tita? O support na lang daw. Ano ba yung tatanong ko, Jules? <laughs> ah! Ano na lang, Charles, ah, ano sa tingin mo yung magiging, kasi, ilang years na kayo magkasama ni Sara, tapos dalawa na rin yung, yung anak ninyo. After the wedding, ano ba sa tingin mo, will it make any difference? Will it make your, your relationship stronger? Uh, o tingin nyo eh, strong na kaya yung marriage, yung wedding itself, will just be a legacy na para maging mas matatag pa. And with the blessing of, of course, of the church. Yes, of course. Um, for us, um, like what you said, we've been, you know, we've been through a lot. We've been together for a long time, and now that we're finally getting married, we're considering this parang as a new chapter, a uh, new beginning for both of us. You know, with the blessing of our family, the blessing of God. You know, and we're very excited about this new chapter, and you know how we're gonna face our marriage life. Uh, married life and yeah, we're considering it as a new beginning for our relationship and it's exciting. Thank you. Uh, <laughs> sure, ilang baby plan? After the wedding, may mga ilang baby plan? Um, kasi gusto ko magkaroon ng basketball team. <laughs> 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 joke lang. Um, We'll see. As of now, we're happy with our two boys. Um, napag-usapan napag na rin namin ni Sarah yan. Um, we'll see. We'll see. We'll, we'll take it one step up. Mer ano muna? Marriage muna. And enjoy first the two boys. Yeah. Thank you, Charles. At eto, mukhang excited sila kasi may pinagtatalunan sila tungkol yata sa wedding to mga vloggers. Yeah. Si Albert. Yes, Albert. Tapos ikaw, Judah. O, kasi dinig na dinig na dinig na dinig na usapan. Sabi po. Hi, good afternoon po and congrats. Hi, thank you. Um, may specific motive na po ba for, for the wedding? And is there like, parang, I mean, um, overpowering call or na gusto niyong makita namin with your wedding? Or gano'n? I think the general theme is romance, um, old school romance, um, lots of flowers, mga uh, gano'n. <laughs> ano, so mag-share pa? Okay na muna yan, hanggang March pa natin sa ikaw pa yun ito. May kwento lahat. Next, next month, may bago ang word na kapitan. <laughs> Um, pero so far sa ngayon, um, alam namin na it's been uh, March pa. Um, so far, ano na yung na-encounter yung challenges with regards to this year in preparation? Siguro the amount of things lang na we need to parang organize and make sure na everything is on point. Um, ano pa pang challenges? Actually, ang pinaka-challenge pa sa akin yung schedule <laughs> um, Kasi nga parang si Sarah, ang dami na niyang trips with her friends and mga baby, uh, ano uh, A bridal shower, bachelorette, naka-plano naka na siya, meron siya mga four trips. Grabe na ba? Ako? <laughs> Dalawa lang naman. Ako kahit isa, wala pa ako na-organize ng trip. 
with my boy, wala pa. So, umihingi pa ako ng schedule. Ano meron kang um, bachelor's night sa so Yeah. <laughs> Um, pero aside from that, siguro sa the scheduling, I think, I think yeah, we, we have more people helping us out and siguro just making sure that everything is on track. Um, the guest list also, you know, we need to the guest list. Um, so yeah, mga, mga little details like that. And last for me, um, ano pala yung naging reaction ni Zion no? nalaman niya na, ay, ito magpapakasal yung mga magdari ko. I mean, may, may inter... Ano yung reaction niya sa concept na gano'n na ito may wedding siya pupunta at yung parents niya yung... Ano. I think kasi Zion six years old, so wala pa masyado yung... Alam niya kung ano yung wedding, um, kung para saan yun, pero hindi pa yung klaro as a, let's say, nine year old kid or ten year old kid. Pero tuwing sinasabi niya, nakikita niya kung gaano kami kasaya mag-usap about the wedding, mag-plano about the wedding. So nahahawa siya sa happiness namin every time we get him involved. So ganun siya nag-react when he sees us na masaya talking about the wedding. Doon siya nag-react. Thank you. Thank you. Yan. Uh, bago natin puntahan si Tita Mercy. Yan. Ang ganda ng ano, uh, era, no? Winner. Yeah. Oh, yung giveaways natin. Ni... Personalized. Oh, Pinagawa talaga ng ano. Ito yung bagong endorsement ko. No? Yes. Oh, Thank you to New USA. Yeah. Maganda yan. Collagen, pampabata, and glutathione. Nakaka-touch, no? Pagawa talaga si Tita Mercy. Yung packets for best press. Yeah. At syempre dyan, yung mga masigil natin. Uh, team ni Miss Jasmine Pamela. Nagpagawa rin ng mga pillows and uh, bags. tote bags. Yeah. Oh, thank you. Thank you. So, so much. Si Miss Jasmine Pamela ang uh, business unit head natin. Oh, para dito sa wedding special. Thank so, you Miss Jasmine. So, sa'yo na po. Oh. <laughs> 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 live na live. Kasi nang nangyong pasakit. Ang kanayang magwala pag napatuloy. We are down to our last Three questions. Ito na si Tita Mercy Lee Hardy. Nangangarap din po si Tita Mercy na someday ay makapagpakasal siya. Siyempre gusto niya yung stag party. Medyo nalungkot siya kasi hindi pa nalala. Na-approve yung mga. Tita Mercy! Yan, ganda ka rin. Oo, oo, oo. Or just mapapaya. Hindi ko nga alam. Alam ko ano siya. Ang pangkakot na kanilang. Ang pangkakot na kanilang. Ang pangkakot na kanilang. Ang pangkakot na kanilang. This is the right man and the right woman for me. The merch life tayo. Alive tayo sa ano. Maraming bata na nuno. Nanunod si Zion. Sa mata nga, Kuya Jood, sa mata. Anyway, yes, noong una kong nakita si Sarah, actually nakita ko nga siya before, sa kabilang network. Napansin ko parang, parang nagkaroon ako ng ano, anong tawag doon? Intuition? Tama ba yun? May parang feeling na, parang may connection ka doon, parang ganun. Meron, meron akong maramdaman na ganun. Parang intuition. Tingle ba yung tawag doon? Meron din po ko nga. Si Richard yung nagsabi, si Sean. Kay Tita Mercy ba yung dati? Makaloka si Tita Mercy. Oo, makaloka si Tita Mercy. Ano na lang? Jingle, jingle. Oo, kanina pinigilig yung lahat. Sarah naman. Ako pinagpikipay niyo. Sarah, ito naman. Ano? 
Ano din naman ko, nung first time ko siya nakita, um, nagwapo na ako sa kanya, um, nagka-crush din ako agad sa kanya, and um, nagka-gusto. So, ayun. Uh, meron mga misis ng tahanan na hindi nila kasundo ang kanilang mother in law Alala na pag nag, pagka naghihiwa daw na si Buya, si Tumuluha, hindi kasundo ang Ah, uh, natuto ba 'yon? Ah, uh, kasundo ko ba si Lilo? Kita na ba niya? Parang kasud ako kasundo ko po siya. So, <laughs> never gain na ganoon nag- nagkaroon ng uh, medyo baguhan, ay tormento, something like that. There again, there's no perfect relationship po dito. So, of course, may minsan may tampuhan kami, pero lahat naman ng tampuhan kahit kanino man 'yan, pinag-uusapan namin lagi. And The next day, okay na ulit kami. Kasi parang ko na rin siyang mama talaga. So, second mom ko si Tita. And it's normal naman na meron. Kung wala naman, edi hindi totoong relationship po yun. So, Tanong po, yung sa sibuyas po? Meron po bang naghihiwa ng sibuyas na hindi naiiyak? Hindi, pan. Ang babae daw, naghihiwa ng sibuyas, hindi daw makakasundo ang magiging mother in law. Eh, ako ko lang sa iba. Ito naman, it's my maid naman sinasara. Ano din ko? Ito naman, ito naman. Hindi na kailangan mag-iwa. Thank you, ito naman. Hindi na siya matatanong yun. Kasi parang piling ko ano eh. Sige, gumawalang intriga. Alam mo, ito naman, sa totoo lang, sabi ni Tita Arabel ka na, ayaw ko kong eksena. Pero kaya sa mga tanong mo, baka bigla kayo magkaroon ng eksena. Okay, so, we're down Yes, partner, we have a question from another social media influencer. We have the early bird, Jeman Villanueva, the late happy birthday of Orange Maggie. Thank you. Congratulations. Best wishes. Share naman kayo na tips nyo, whether personal, kung paano nyo namu-work out yung relationship nyo, yung pagiging yung koko nyo, and do you get advices then from your parents? or natutuloy niya sa kanila para mag-work yung relationship niya? I guess um, sa relationship namin, parang you know, syempre din niya kami advice ng parents namin, ng mga kaibigan namin, family, pero iba pa rin talaga when it's based on experience, di ba? Parang when people give you advice, you take it, yes, but it's different also when you experience things together when you go through things together. I think Sam and Isara, we just didn't give up on each other. We didn't give up on our relationship. Um, we communicated, we tried to understand each other. Um, like sabi ko kanina, wala namang perfect relationship. It's a constant work and constant um, growth. You know, individually, you know, we, we grow together and then we grow as individuals. It's about respect, um, communication, and also in love, diba? Yung totoong pagmamahal sa isa't isa. Can you give an example, like, kanyari, you don't sleep na magkaaway, or mga ganang bagay? Ayun, that's a perfect example. Um, that I, I would advise to any couple na pag, pag nag-aaway or hindi nagkakasundo, dapat pag-usapan right away. Um, huwag matulog ng galit sa isa't isa. And um, communication, respect, uh, patience are, are very important. And trust. Yeah. And also siguro yung ano, <clears throat> yung time management. <laughs> It's very important also, especially now that we have two kids. Parang, you know, parang pinapasa namin yung bola sa isa't isa. Kung baga, parang ganun. Parang, oh, ikaw naman, oh, ako naman. Ganun. So, tulungan kami. We try to balance each other out. You know, it's not always perfect. You know, yung mga araw na, you know, parang lost kami, stressed kami. But we constantly talk about things and we constantly try to figure out, you know, um, figure out how we're gonna have this time management and how we're gonna handle our family. So it's always, you know, it's good to have constant communication and be open to each other. Yeah. 
Ang hirap kasi iwan ng mga bata. So, kunwari, he's working, I'll be with the kids. Or, I'm working, he'll be with the kids. So, may mga araw na katulad ng sinabi ni Charlie na nasa-stress kami. Or, um, yun yung mga araw na pareho kaming may work and walang kasama yung kids. But then, good thing we have our parents, my mom, uh, Tita Annabelle, and Tito Eddie na laging dumadalaw sa bahay. So, during the days that we're both working, we're thankful that we have our parents to to stay with the kids. Pero we try na maging bihira yun, yung mga ganung araw. Thank you. Thank you, Jana. Jun? Siyempre, uh, bago tayo mag... Uh, last questions, Keith, uh, or meron dyan? Meron uh, Okay, dalawa na lang. Si Keith, tapos isa na yan, last na yan. Pero papasalamatan po natin muna. The party card. PH for the pillows, yes. bags, bags, and a wallet. Mm -hmm. Ang ganda ng ginawa nila. Okay, so, okay, uh, Kate. Okay. Congratulations again. Um, what makes each other um, parang, a husband material and wife material? Yung best trade. Kasi sa, matay, sa tagal na magkasama, ang dami nyo na nabagdaan. So, if may hindi ko pa nasabi na parang, yun yung trade niya na na-appreciate niya. Um, number one, Chad knows me more than anyone in the world. Two, he's the most loving and kind and supportive. He wants me to be better all the time and I think that's important in a relationship because that's giving and wanting the best for each other, not only for their relationship but as individuals and he's like that. And number three, Grabe mapagpahal sa akin at sa, sa kids, sa family ko, and sa family niya. Um, for Sarah, um, she's very loving, not only to me, but you know, to her parents, to the kids, and nakita ko talaga yung perseverance niya. So when she wants something, she's very goal-oriented. Pag meron siyang gusto, she makes sure that, you know, graduating ng lahat para ma-achieve yun. And, just, and she's also very supportive sa akin. Pag may, may goals ako, pag may kailangan akong gawin, she's always there. She's, she's like right there behind me, supporting me. And same, same thing with the kids. You know, she, she finds time to spend with them and you know, support them in every way. Parang the kids niya, ang dating sa akin, yung kids parang ako yung parang kalaro nila eh. Si Sarah talaga yung parang <laughs> si sa nakikinig talaga sila kay Sarah. Ano yan? Parang ako yung fan na nalang parang body yun. Mahal na mahal ng kids si Char. Lalo na si Kai. Kasi uh, si Zion malapit talaga sa akin. And si Kai yung sobrang obsessed kay Char. Pag umaalas si Char talaga umiiyak siya. May separation anxiety si Kai kay, kay Chart. Pero, grabe yung pagmamahal ng kids kay Chart. So, you know, he's doing a, a great job. And lastly, ano to, sino mo yung final say when it comes to um, decision making? So, dami ng wedding preparation options. 